Ukraine's president has said a truce agreed with pro-Russian rebels in the east must be honored, as he ordered the army to stop fighting. Petro Poroshenko also warned the rebels against continuing attacks on the besieged strategic town of Dibutsev. Fighting appeared to have died down after the ceasefire took effect at 2200 hours GMT, according to reports. Earlier on Saturday, Rebel leaders had also ordered their forces to stop fighting in line with the ceasefire. Fighting had raged near the town of Dibultsev just hours before the truce was due to kick in. Ukraine and the West accuse Russia of sending troops and weapons to help the separatists in Ukraine's eastern Donetsk and Luhansk regions, a claim the Kremlin vehemently denies. Last chance in a national broadcast from the military headquarters in Kiev. President Russian ordered the commander of what Ukraine describes as an anti-terror operation to observe the ceasefire. Mr. Poroshenko expressed hopes that perhaps the last chance for peace won't be lost, adding that agreements must be honored, and we are expecting that the ceasefire deal will be adhered to. He stressed that Ukraine had always fulfilled its international obligations and would prove it this time. The ceasefire deal was brokered on Thursday in Minsk. Belarus by Mr. Poroshenko, Russian President Vladimir Putin, French President François Hollande and German Chancellor Angela Merkel.